On the same day that Jesus was resurrected, two of Jesus' disciples were walking to a village called Emmaus. Emmaus was about seven miles from Jerusalem. The two disciples were talking about everything that had happened. While they were talking, Jesus came up and began walking with them. They did not recognize Jesus. What are you talking about, Jesus asked. The disciples stopped walking. They looked sad. One of the disciples said, Are you the only person in Jerusalem who doesn't know what has happened these last few days? What happened, Jesus asked. The disciples told him about Jesus, the man from Nazareth. He was a prophet, they said. He was powerful, and he did and said wonderful things. But the religious leaders handed him over to be killed, and he died on a cross. We were hoping that he was the one who was going to save Israel. The disciples said that these things happened three days ago. They said that some women had gone to the tomb that morning, but they could not find Jesus' body. The women said they had seen angels, and the angels said Jesus was alive. Some of us who followed Jesus went to the tomb, and it was just as the women said, they explained. They did not see Jesus. His body was not there. Jesus said to them, Don't you believe everything the prophets said? Did the Messiah have to suffer and die to be glorified? Then Jesus taught the two disciples everything in the scriptures that was written about him. He talked about the books written by Moses and the prophets. Jesus and the two disciples arrived at Emmaus, and they asked Jesus to stay with them. So Jesus joined them at the dinner table. He took the bread, thanked God for it, and broke it into pieces. Then he gave the pieces to the disciples. Right away, the men realized who the man was, Jesus. But immediately, Jesus disappeared from their sight. The two disciples thought about their walk to Emmaus. When Jesus talked to us on the road and explained the scriptures, didn't our hearts feel like they were on fire? They immediately left Emmaus and went back to Jerusalem. They found Jesus, his 11 disciples, and others who gathered with them. They told them what happened and how they recognized Jesus when he was at dinner with them. The 11 had news for them too. They said Jesus had appeared to Simon Peter. Jesus is alive. The Bible is about Jesus. When Adam and Eve sinned, God began working out his plan to send Jesus to rescue people from sin. All of the Old Testament points forward to Jesus' life, death, and resurrection, the time when Jesus would bring God's promised salvation for sinners.